The Kellogg's building on 84th and J Street is the largest cold food manufacturing plant in North America. Day and night, six days a week, this has been the scene outside the various gates. Employees say they're longtime workers and just want treatment and pay that's fair. Uh, there's 1,400 of, of us with Kellogg's and we need to stick together and to see this through so that we can all have better paying jobs for the future for our young people coming in. Both Republicans and Democrats have supported the workers' plea for fair wages. A poll by Anoto Global says 73% of Americans agree with Kellogg's workers' strike. However, Kellogg's remains unwilling to budge. The company is making record profits, making $21 billion in 2020. Executives have taken a 20% increase in compensation, while plant workers' pay increase wasn't even enough to counteract inflation. Along with this, Kellogg's wants to get rid of its two-tier system for wages. Is it, it's eventually going to take all of the employees and put them down into the lower tier. So all employees will be making $12 an hour less, their insurance premiums will go way up, they'll take less vacation time and less vacation pay. Around 70% of workers are in Tier 2 and would be affected by the new pay scale. They remain hopeful that Kellogg's will reach an agreement if they keep up the pressure. For the Omaha News, I'm Grace Bellinghausen.